This is the second video, or part two, of our two-part word definition series. So please don't forget to study part one of this video series. In this video, I will guide you on how to give simple and easy to remember definitions for commonly asked words. I hope this will help prepare you for your upcoming interview. Now, if you're ready, let's get started. If you received a suspended sentence, were placed on probation, or were paroled, have you completed your suspended sentence, probation, or parole? No. What does suspended sentence mean? A legal delay in a sentence. What does suspended sentence mean? A legal delay in a sentence. What does probation mean? To get out of prison early but must report to an officer regularly. What does probation mean? To get out of prison early, but must report to an officer regularly. Can you explain what parole means? To let go from jail early. Can you explain what parole means? To let go from jail early. Have you ever engaged in prostitution, attempted to procure, or import prostitutes or persons for the purpose of prostitution, or received any proceeds or money from prostitution? No. What does prostitution mean? The business of having sex for money. What does prostitution mean? The business of having sex for money. What is a prostitute? A person who has sex with someone for money. What is a prostitute? A person who has sex with someone for money. Have you ever manufactured, cultivated, produced, distributed, dispensed, sold, or smuggled any controlled substances, illegal drugs, narcotics, or drug paraphernalia? In violation of any law or regulation of a U.S. state, the United States, or a foreign country. No. What does controlled substances mean? Drugs or special medicine that is tightly controlled by the government. What does controlled substances mean? Drugs or special medicine that is tightly controlled by the government. Do you understand what smuggled means? To bring something illegally into the country. Do you understand? What smuggled means. To bring something illegally into the country. Do you know what narcotics mean? 
illegal drugs such as heroin and cocaine. Do you know what narcotics mean? Illegal drugs such as heroin and cocaine. Have you ever been married to more than one person at the same time? No. Have you ever married someone in order to obtain an immigration benefit? No. What does immigration benefit mean? Things like visa or green card given by the U.S. government. What does immigration benefit mean? Things like visa or green card given by the U.S. government. What does it mean to obtain? To get something. What does it mean to obtain? To get something. Have you ever helped anyone to enter or try to enter the United States illegally? No. Have you ever gambled illegally or received income from illegal gambling? No. What does gamble illegally or illegal gambling mean? Games for money not allowed by law, like horse betting. What does gamble illegally or illegal gambling mean? Games for money not allowed by law, like horse betting. Have you ever failed to support your dependents or to pay alimony? No. Can you explain to me what support your dependents mean? Like paying for child support. Can you explain to me what support your dependents mean? Like paying for child support. What does pay alimony mean? Money paid to an ex-spouse after a divorce. What does pay alimony mean? Money paid to an ex-spouse after a divorce. Have you ever made any misrepresentation to obtain any public benefit in the United States? No. Can you explain what misrepresentation means? To give wrong information by not telling the truth. Can you explain what misrepresentation means? To give wrong information by not telling the truth. Do you know what public benefit is? Welfare like food stamps. Do you know what public benefit is? 
welfare like food stamps. Have you ever given any U.S. government officials any information or documentation that was false, fraudulent, or misleading? No. Do you understand what fraudulent means? Telling a lie to get something you want. Do you understand what fraudulent means? Telling a lie to get something you want. What does misleading mean? To give a wrong idea. What does misleading mean? To give a wrong idea. Have you ever lied to any U.S. government officials to gain entry or admission into the United States or to gain immigration benefits while in the United States? No. What does it mean to gain? To get something useful. What does it mean to gain? To get something useful. What is immigration benefit? Things like visa or green card given by the U.S. government. Have you ever been placed in removal, rescission, or deportation proceedings? No. What is rescission? To cancel your stay in the United States. What is rescission? To cancel your stay in the United States. What does deportation mean? Force a person to leave a country. What does deportation mean? Force a person to leave a country. Have you ever been removed or deported from the United States? No. Are you a person born as a male who lived in the United States at any time between your 18th and 26th birthdays? No. Have you ever left the United States to avoid being drafted in the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Do you know what drafted means? Being selected to join the Army. Do you know what drafted means? Being selected to join the Army. What does it mean to avoid being drafted? To prevent from being selected. What does it mean to avoid being drafted? To prevent from being selected. Have you ever applied for any kind of exemption from military service in the U.S. Armed Forces? 
No. What is exemption? A special permission not to do something. What is exemption? A special permission not to do something. Have you ever served in the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Are you currently a member of the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Have you ever been court martialed or have you received a discharge characterized as other than honorable, bad conduct, or dishonorable while in the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Have you ever been discharged from training or service in the U.S. Armed Forces because you were an alien? No. Have you ever deserted from the U.S. Armed Forces? No. Do you now have, or did you ever have, a hereditary title or an order of nobility in any foreign country? No. Do you know what hereditary title is? A royal title such as prince or princess. Do you know what hereditary title is? A royal title such as prince or princess. What does order of nobility mean? A position given by a king or queen. What does order of nobility mean? A position given by a king or queen. Do you support the Constitution and form of government of the United States? Yes, I do. What does Constitution mean? The supreme law of the land. What does Constitution mean? The supreme law of the land. What is the form of government of the United States? Republic. What is the form of government of the United States? Republic. Do you understand the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Yes, I do. Do you understand the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Yes, I do. What does oath of allegiance mean? A promise to be loyal to the United States. What does oath of allegiance mean? A promise to be loyal to the United States. Are you willing to take the full oath of allegiance to the United States? Yes. If the law requires it, are you willing to bear arms on behalf of the United States? Yes. What does bear arms mean? 
to carry weapons like a gun or knife. What does bare arms mean? To carry weapons like a gun or knife. If the law requires it, are you willing to perform non-combatant services in the U.S. Armed Forces? Yes. What are non-combatant services? Work that does not include fighting. What are non-combatant services? Work that does not include fighting. If the law requires it, are you willing to perform work of national importance under civilian direction? Yes. What is work of national importance? Non-military work that is important to the country. What is work of national importance? Non-military work that is important to the country. What does civilian mean? A person who is not in the military. What does civilian mean? A person who is not in the military. Do you understand what under civilian direction means? Orders from someone not in the military. Do you understand what under civilian direction means? Orders from someone not in the military. For more U.S. citizenship tests, mock interviews, and study guides, please click on the subscribe button and notification bell now so you won't miss our latest videos.